Here at the Santa Clara County Office of Emergency Management, officials began the day by being able to say they had jumped ahead of schedule in terms of giving out vaccinations. But now, after the governor's announcement, they aren't so sure. Satya Kalra of San Jose is 76 years old and doing his best to stay healthy during the pandemic. In terms of getting a vaccine shot, Satya, the father of South Bay Assemblyman Ash Kalra, is listed in Tier 1B, Tier 1A being mainly frontline health workers. The county had said it hoped to start vaccinating 1B at the end of the month, but the county expanded sites and gave supplies to private health providers and are now vaccinating 6,000 people a day. So the county made those 75 years and older eligible. Satya has a vaccine appointment for Monday. I'm very happy to get this vaccine, and I was waiting for that because I was very anxious because of my health situation. But the governor's announcement to now include 65-year-olds has Santa Clara County playing catch-up again. Today, the county said it cannot keep up without adding more vaccine supply. Uh, we did make a request on Sunday uh, for 100,000 additional doses and uh, the state authorized an additional 6,000. San Mateo County says it is still just focusing on Tier 1A and announced a new online hotline for the public to ask questions. For the Calra family, opening up to 65-year-olds is still a positive step for counties. But it gives them the green light the moment that they have any kind of vaccination supply that they can give out, they can start opening it up to 65 and older. With about 300,000 people over 65 years old in the county, that green light is still red. In San Jose, Robert Honda, NBC Bay Area News.